now we will see about bubble sort program for this you have to add two directories and you have to write uh, void main you have to start the program from void main and first you have to declare the variables what are the variables we are taking here one array that is length of 10 and i j k t i means to store the elements in array we are using in that loop i j and k for sorting and t is temp variable so these are integer variables next first c, uh, c out entered the elements to array okay for this we are using for loop and storing the elements in array according to index we are storing elements so next we are displaying the array what uh, what is the L, uh, array that we entered in in that array so here we are displaying the entered elements in array next here our main logic will start okay for k is equal to 1 k less than 10 k plus plus so how many times we are repeating the array for that calculation k is equal to 1 and inside the array for index we are using j integer j so so uh, forget about j here j is small letter you have to write j same in all places so so here we are checking index positions and com comparing with condition a of j greater than a of j plus 1 so if the condition true we are storing a of j into temporary variable and a of j me hum a of j plus 1 position may counts a variable by hi wo store kare and a of j plus 1 is equal to temp so a of j is storing to a of j plus 1 a of j plus 1 place me a of j plus 1 store kare so after sorting the final array final sorted array will be displaying here so now what is the process is going here so first we have to take one array and store the elements in that array our array is length of 10 so 7 8 6 1 2 9 10 3 4 5 these are our array elements and this is our array so our index number is starting from 0 to 9 so here you can observe in this array so i wrote 0 to 9 positions and i wrote elements in the array left side i wrote the logic also so first starting position uh, of our array is k is equal to 1 and for j is equal to 0 so j is equal to 0 matlab 0 position se hum check kare so a of 0 greater than a of 0 plus 1 that is a of 0 greater than a of 1 so a of 0 position mein kaun sa variable number hai 7 and 7 a greater than 8 is this condition true no so we have to move next position next you have to check the condition a of 1 greater than a of 2 8 greater than 6 so this condition will true and it will uh, exchange the values so exchange ke liye humne t is equal to a of j a of j is equal to a of j plus 1 a of j plus 1 is equal to t so this swap program you know already so here we are uh, exchanging the values no now our new sorted array is 7 6 8 1 2 9 10 3 4 again we are checking the condition a of 2 greater than a of 3 so 8 greater than 1 this condition will true and it will exchange the values new array will be displayed like this 7 6 1 8 2 9 10 3 5 again we are checking the condition a of 3 greater than a of 4 8 greater than 2 this condition will also be true and our new sorted array is here our positions are check, uh, exchanging 8 will be goes to the poor position and 2 will become a three po third position so 7 6 1 2 8 9 10 3 5 again we have to check the condition a of 4 greater than a of 5 matlab a of sorry 8 greater than 9 this condition will fail again you have to check the condition 
and increase the value of j a of 5 greater than a of 6 9 greater than 10 so this condition will fail and again you have to increase the j value a of 6 greater than a of 7 so this condition will be true and it will exchange the values now our new array is 7 6 1 2 8 9 3 10 4 5 so a of next you have to increase the j value and check the condition a of 7 greater than a of 8 10 greater than 4 this condition will be true and it will exchange the values again you have to increase the j value check the condition a of 8 greater than a of 9 so 10 greater than 5 and you have to change the values exchange the values your new sorted array at the end of k is equal to 1 7 6 1 2 8 9 3 4 5 10 so at, for k is equal to 1 your sorted array is this new sorted array is this now you have to increase k value that is k is equal to k plus 1 previous k value is 1 and you have to increase 1 now your k value is 2 again you have to compare the elements in array ok logic is there in left position so first position se aap humne check karna hai 7 greater than 6 so this condition will be true and it will exchange the values your sorted array you can find here left side uh, bottom so next you have to check the condition a of 1 greater than a of 2 7 greater than 1 this condition will be true and it will exchange the values you can write you can find the new array here again you have to increase the position of j and you have to check the condition 7 greater than 2 this condition also true and you have to exchange the values you can find the new array and you have to increase the value of j this condition will be false and you have to increase the j value again you have to check the condition this condition also fail and again you have to check the condition a of 5 greater than a of 6 9 greater than 3 this condition will be true and it will exchange the values your you can find the new array here 6 1 2 7 8 3 9 4 5 10 so again you have to increase the j value and check the condition 9 greater than 4 it will be true and you have to exchange the values you can find the new array here okay continuation of this 6 1 2 7 8 3 4 9 5 10 this is our present array so again you are increasing j value and checking the condition 9 uh, sorry a of 7 greater than a of 8 9 greater than 5 this condition also true and it will exchange the values and again it will check the condition a of 8 and a of 9 so this condition is fail your new sorted array is 6 1 2 7 8 3 4 5 9 10 here you are increasing k value previous k value is 2 and you are increasing k value 1 you are repeating the loop at third time main th uh, main loop is third time so again you are checking in array inside the array from position 0 to 9 okay first a of 0 to is greater than a of 1 6 is greater than 1 it will exchange the value and forms a new array again it will uh, increase the j value check the condition a of 1 greater than a of 2 6 greater than 2 this condition will be true and it will exchange the uh, values and you can fi uh, find the array next it will increase j value and check the condition so this condition will be fails again you you are checking in uh, a of 3 greater than a of 4 matlab 7 8 greater than 8 so this condition will be failed and again you have to increase j position and check the condition 8 greater than 3 this will be true and you are exchanging the values and you can find the new array here again you are increasing j value and checking the condition this condition also true and it, here you are exchanging the values of 5 and 6 ok next your new uh, previous array continuation this page so in this uh, array 
you are checking a of 6 and a of 7 so this condition will be true a of 6 is equal to 5 and a of 7 is equal to 8 your new array is 1 2 6 7 3 4 5 8 9 10 so again you are checking the condition this condition will be fail and a of 8 greater than a of 9 this condition also fail again you have to increase k value what is previous k value k value is equal to 3 and you have to increase 1 now your k value is 4 and you have to repeat the process and continue the loop now e of 0 for, now you have to check inside the array from 0 position to 9 so first here 1 2 6 7 3 4 5 8 9 so first two position may uh, change nahi hoga you can ch uh, change will be happen from position 2 so uh, 1 greater than 2 this condition fail and 2 greater than 6 this condition also fail now a of 2 greater than a of 3 this condition also fail and a of 3 greater than a of 4 ok so here it will exchange the values 7 and 3 so third position may 3 aayega fourth position may 7 aayega so you can find the new array here and again you have to check the condition a of 4 greater than 5 7 greater than 4 this will be true and it will be exchanging the values here again you have to check the condition e of 5 greater than f6 this condition also true and it will exchange the values your new array you can find here 1 2 6 3 4 5 7 8 9 10 so again you have to check the condition it will be fail it uh, so this from number 7 these are uh, all sorted so you, directly you uh, so it will check the condition continuously and your k value be, value will be increasing now so k value will be 5 and you are running the loop for array at uh, fifth time so your present array is 1 2 6 3 4 5 7 8 9 only Six is there in middle it now we have to send this six to before seven so for this you have to check the condition in loop a of zero greater than a of one so this condition fail so up to uh, two uh, first to two positions this is sorted and third position it is not sorted so e of two greater than e of three six greater than three so this condition true and it will exchange the values next it will compare with fourth position and this condition also true so now we are moving six to before seven so this condition will be true and it will exchange the values now one two three four six and five seven eight nine so now you have to check one more condition and this condition also true automatically it exchange the values so now our new sorted array is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so we arranged the elements in array in order ascending order so it will repeat the loop and ch uh, check all conditions so already array is sorted so all condition will be failed and again it will increase the k value and to 10 and continue the process after uh, array it is exit from the uh, loop and k value uh, k condition will be checked and it can, it can it will be print our new sorted array for to print all uh, array you have to use last for loop also so for this also i will show the logic so our array is sorted and you have to print the values the final sorted array for i is equal to 0 i less than 10 i plus plus so by using this loop you are printing the values so i hope you understand the program of bubble sort thank you thanks for watching